Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Agriculture with Samir and in this video we will be learning about one more competitive functions in an intercropping system. So in the last video we learned about land equivalent ratio and in the other previous video we have learned about different competitive relationships in an intercropping system. So in this video we will be learning about uh, competent uh, relative yield total. So we can say RYT. So RYT is generally calculated and it is the oldest method to determine the efficiency of an intercropping system. So when the crops are grown in an intercropping system, to find out the efficiency we have to calculate the RYT. So according to the values, we can determine the efficiency of the intercropping systems. So there are different values and the value varies from one intercropping system to other. And it helps us in determining if the efficiency of the intercropping system is good for cropping or not. So generally, this is uh, RYT is calculated to find that if the crops are sharing the available resources in a proper way or not. That is, whatever all resources are available, if it is being utilized by each and every crop according to the requirement or not. So this is mainly to calculate the efficiency use of efficient use of resources in an intercropping system. So let us know the values by which we can determine that how RYT can help us in determining the efficiency of an intercropping system. So here I have certain values like 1 to 2. So if we get a value of RYT from 1 to 2, then we can say that there is no competition between crops and there is equal sharing of resources between two crops. So here the output comes okay and expected according to our uh, field and according to our expectations. So there is no fluctuation in output we can say as the resources are equally being taken by each and every crop for the growth and development. So now what if we get a value less than one? So if we get a value less than one, then we can say that there is some suppressive effect of one crop or the other or there is some mis, uh, misgap or uh, com, mis, and uh, we can say that there is some uh, lag between the resources intake of one crop and uh, one crop can uptake more amount of nutrients, more amount of resources available in the farming system. So we can say that allelopathy is a suppressive effect when, less than, when we get a ROIT less than one. When we get RYT less than 1, we can say 